Hello everyone, I'm a Rainbow and this is my introduction to Flipside Studio. I'm a big fan of this free program on the Quest 2 that makes it very easy to create professional looking content in virtual reality. The program is feature rich and is like having a production studio at your fingertips. There are sets, avatars, cameras, props, teleprompters, and a whole host of production tools that allow you to become your own content studio. I could talk about this awesome program for an hour, but it'll be even better if I demonstrate how easy it is to get started in Flipside Studio for yourself. To get started, you'll need Flipside Studio on your headset, the Flipside Broadcaster app, and OBS Studio on your PC. They're all free, and there's a link in the description to each of them. Let's get started. When you drop into Flipside, each time you'll start with a dashboard. It'll contain information about the last project you worked on, along with the settings menu. However, we don't need that to begin. We'll open up the menu using the A or X controller buttons and find the project icon. Flipside organizes everything into projects, so I'm going to start a new one right now. Let's call this FST for Flipside Tutorials. In the project folder, you'll see a batch of categories. You can also access these via the icon menu across the bottom. Either one works. Let's pick a background setting. Flipside's got a batch, but I'm going to go with News to Start. Now we're in the News Studio, let's head over to the desk. I don't have a character selected yet, so I'm essentially in ghost mode. This allows me to move around easily and just use my controllers. I can also increase and decrease my relative size. This is handy for setting up shots and props. I'm going to take this opportunity to delete the one visible camera on the set. Now let's pick my characters. Flipside comes with a dozen built in. I'm going to choose Felix. I'll add them to the project. Then I'm going to find Orlag and I'll add them to the project. Now I'll select Felix as my avatar for the first scene. Once that avatar is loaded, you'll see their ghostly shape around you. You'll be visible to the recordings now and you'll be able to interact with the set. Let's take a look around. Currently, there's no cameras on the set. I wanted to make a point of this because you don't need any cameras to actually record your performances. All you have to do is hit the record button. You'll get a quick countdown. Anything you do or say as your avatar will be recorded until you hit the stop button. Hello everybody, I'm Felix. Welcome to the Flipside Studio News. And our special guest today is Mr. Orlag. And we're going to be talking to him about D&D &D cosplay right after the weather report. To review the performance, navigate to it. Then press the play button. Hello everybody, I'm Felix. Welcome to the Flipside Studio News. And our special guest today is Mr. Orlag. And we're going to be talking to him about D&D &D cosplay right after the weather report. If you're happy with your performance, keep it. Otherwise, just discard it and try again. Once you're done with the recording, you can unload it but for now, I'm going to keep it for the next performance. Flipside will let you collaborate with others in VR. Since I don't currently have anyone to team up with, I'll film the second part of this myself. To do that, I'll need to bring in my Orlag character. Once I've done that, I'll get into position then I'll hit record. 
The previously loaded recording starts immediately. Hello, everybody. I'm Felix. Welcome to the Flipside Studio News. And our special guest today is Mr. Orlag. Hello. And we're going to be talking to him about D&D cosplay right after the weather report. Once the first recording is done playing, the second recording will cut itself automatically. You'll have the option to keep it or discard. Let's play it back to see how we like it. Hello, everybody. I'm Felix. Welcome to the Flipside Studio News. And our special guest today is Mr. Orlag. Hello. And we're going to be talking to him about D&D cosplay right after the weather report. This works for my demonstration, but if you're not happy with your recording, just discard it and try again until you are. Now we're ready to send the camera output to the flip side broadcaster. Let's open up a camera, find the angle that you want to shoot from. Once you have it, you're ready to record that camera to your PC. Start up Flipside Broadcaster on your PC. You'll get a screen pop-up for a code. For now, just wait. Open up OBS Studio on your PC. Hit the plus sign to add a source. Select Window Capture and Flipside Broadcaster. Then hit Start Recording in OBS. Let's jump back onto the headset. Open the menu and select Camera Switcher. You're, you'll see a couple of views. One will be the camera you set up. The other will be your point of view. Select the camera. Press the button that says Start Cast. You'll get a pop-up in your headset with a three-digit code. Type that code into the Flipside Broadcaster window. Once it's accepted, the output you select from the camera switcher will be displayed on the screen. You can switch the point of view at any time. Now, press the play button for the recording Hello, you everybody. made earlier. I'm Felix. Welcome to the Flipside Studio News. And our special guest today is Mr. Orlag. Hello, and we're going to be talking to him about D&D &D cosplay right after the weather report. Once the scene is done playing, reposition the camera for a different angle. Hello, Press everybody. play again. You can repeat this process Studio as many news. times as you want, and as many angles as you want. Is Mr. Orlag. Hello. For and this demonstration, we're, we're just going to do a couple, D &D so we're done with Flipside. Right after the now you'll need to edit the file or files you've recorded in OBS. While I edit, let's recap. In this introduction to Flipside, you've learned how to start a project, how to add sets, how to create your main character performance, how to layer in a second character, how to record the entire scene in as many angles as you wish, how to export it to your PC using Flipside Broadcaster. While there's still a lot more for you to learn about Flipside Studio, these are the basics that will get you up and running. Mr. Orlag, hello. And we're going to be talking to him about D&D &D cosplay right after the weather report. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like button and maybe think about subscribing. I really appreciate the support I get from everyone. I love answering questions. They often lead to other videos, so please don't be shy about hitting me up in the comments. I've got another Flipside Studio tutorial about scripts, slides, and the teleprompter in the pipeline. Check the end of this video or in the description for a link. 
I'm a rainbow. Thanks so much for your time. Y'all be good. Bye now.